Okay, so now we're going to talk about the division properties. Topic one was multiplication properties, so here are division. What we're going to look at first is what we're calling what x to the fifth and x to the third mean. So x to the fifth is x times x times x times x times x. x to the third is x times x times x. So what happens? Well, x over x we know is 1. So if x over x is 1, x over x is 1, x over x is 1, 1 times 1 times 1 times x times x is x squared. Okay? Let's look at a number, another one. x to the seventh over x to the fifth. So x to the seventh, there's seven x's. x to the fifth, there are five of them. And what happens? They cancel, 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 cancel. You're left with x squared. Now, how do we get 2 from 5 and 3? How do we get 2 from 7 and 5? Yeah, we subtract. So when it's a to the x over a to the y, that would be a to the x minus y. Okay, you subtract. So with multiplication, you actually added x plus y. With division, you are subtracting. Okay, now in our examples, we have these things called coefficients, okay, 14 and 2. You treat those just like normal numbers, okay. If you need to cover up half, cover up the other half and just do like 14 divided by 2, okay, reduce that. And then deal with your x to the 6 over x to the 4th, that's when you are subtracting, okay. So 14 divided by 2, we know is 7. And then x to the 6 divided by x to the 4th. 6 minus 4 is 2. So you'd be left with x squared. Okay. The next one, with the 24 and the 8, those are coefficients. You deal with them just like numbers. Negative 24 over 8. 8 goes into 24 three times. So that'll be a negative 3. And then you have x to the 6 over x. So think it's 6. When it's just x, it's to the first at one exponent. So 6 minus 1 is x to the third, or x, I'm sorry, 6 minus 1 is x to the fifth. So you have x to the fifth, and then y to the third and y, 3 minus 1 is y squared. Okay, so sorry, you can't read that. It's going to be negative 3, x to the fifth, y squared. Okay, with the next one, we multiply... And we're dividing all in one, okay? It's up to you how you want to do it, but you can multiply straight across, okay? 3 a to the fifth times a to the fourth. Well, a to the fifth times a to the fourth. 5 plus 4 is a to the ninth. And then 9 times 1 is 9. a squared times a to the third. 2 plus 3 is a to the fifth. And then you reduce. The 3 and the 9 reduce to 1 third, okay, so you're going to have 1 third, and then 8 of the 9th and 8 of the 5th, 9 minus 5 is a to the 4th. So you can write it as 1 third a to the 4th, or a to the 4th over 3. Okay, that was my dog dropping his very loud bone. Sorry about that. Okay, so that is it for the division property. Go ahead and pause it and try the U tries, and we'll pick up at um, the next slide after that. Okay, product of a quotient. Very similar to product... Um, Oh, power, that should not say product, that should say power of a quotient, sorry about that, typo. Okay, power of a quotient, very similar to power of a product, okay? When we had the x, y, all the third, it was x to the third and y to the third, same thing here. x over y to the third means x over y times x over y times x over y, giving you x times x times x is x cubed, y times y times y is y cubed, okay? So x cubed over y cubed. Now when you have x over y to the n, same thing, that n has to go to both. So it's going to be x to the n over y to the n. Okay? So in our example here, yes, this fourth power needs to go to everything, to the 2, to the a squared, to the 3, and to the b to the fifth. Okay? So basically to everything. You have 2 to the fourth, 
you have a squared to the fourth, and on the bottom you have 3 to the fourth and b to the fifth to the fourth. Okay, so 2 to the fourth, 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 is 16. a squared to the fourth, that's power to a power, right? So we multiply those, 2 times 4 is a to the eighth. And on the bottom, 3 to the fourth, 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 is 81. b to the fifth to the fourth, 5 times 4 is 20. So b to the 20th. So there's your example there, and you have one more spot of you tries, and that's it for topic two.